manufacturers on the draw fronts we used a man-made material that was alligator a style draw fronts and we used them on the his and hers dresser drawers as well as we used them on hampers both their hampers and then we had some other drawers in the closet under her long hang where we used those we came up with it just took the color palette that they wanted to use and what they were going to design the house like you know you have this dream of how it's going to look when it's done and you create it on paper and you're able to design it you can't import textures like this but what we did was we took everything that we wanted to do with this closet and we actually set it on my conference table and we put it together there so that we had the vision of what all of these components and textures would look like together and that's when we fell in love with it and said it works and there was some that we put in there originally that didn't get to the final design. As we're looking at it and seeing it on the table and looking at the design on the computer, we're getting and imagining exactly how this would work. That's how we came together with it all. Biggest thing is, is in model homes like this, we have to have the pricing for this so that when a client comes walking in, and as we've had with these closets, and immediately out of the mouth is, I want it exactly like it was modeled. And so we lay all of that out, but yet we can still, if that happens to go over budget for somebody, that we can back it off. You look at a dresser and you see that those are alligator draw fronts and they ran X amount of dollars. Well, I don't want to quite spend that on there. So I, I can remove them and put a different color on there. Maybe same color. Maybe it's just a, a different texture. It's the same texture that the whole closet was done in. Mm -hmm.